Hi there, howdy everyone, I am Tampa J, and I broke the stem off my pumpkin. I'm sorry buddy, I didn't mean it. He's been rolling around the back seat of my car for almost a month now. Oh yes, we are in Orlando. You can tell by the palm tree right there. Yeah, there's palm trees everywhere in Florida, but I don't know what I was doing with that. We're doing a video of some different sort of kind of variety today. We're just hanging out here in Orlando. I'm gonna hang out with a friend. We're hitting up a record store because it's record store day. But we're gonna hang out and possibly I might be hitting up Walt Disney World with some other friends. Wherever I go, you go with me. And today is friend day for me. So you're my friend also. So we're all hanging out together. You see what I'm doing here? I hope we have fun. Thanks for always joining me guys. It wouldn't be the same without you. Let's start this video. There is much ahead my friends. There is much ahead. I'm sorry about the stem. Oh man, I can't believe I broke it. Poor fella. Just cruising in the Winter Park neighborhood of Orlando. Right around the corner is the first stop of the day. My friend's waiting on me. They had my stuff. You got your stuff. Did you get a lot of cool records? A couple. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and this is the first stop of the day? I'm pretty oh. happy. Yo, know, you got a whole like clutch collection there. Oh, they, they had everything on my list except for two DVDs, so I'm hoping they still got the two DVDs down at East West. Found a few extras. Oh boy, my box is breaking. Okay, you better get to the car. <laughs> All right, I'm late. Next record store. Next! We'll go there. Salvador Van Gogh. Whoop, whoop. Okay, East West Records. There we go. We're, let's see, 17 minutes, 8.3 miles. I'm uh, really tired. I was pretty much up all night editing the scary train video that, if you're watching this, came out yesterday. I got a hotel in Ocala, and I think I edited to about three o'clock in the morning, woke up around seven, so got a little bit of shut eye. Was able to grab a couple of these, a little Java monster. I don't normally do the Java monster, but I was in a hurry and I didn't want to sit in the drive-through of the Dunkin' Donuts. I wanted to get on the road. Hello, downtown Orlando. Yes, there are more than theme parks in Orlando. There is a downtown area. It's quite nice. Been there a few times. After a few wrong turns, I finally made it to East West Records. Vinyl records and CDs, as it says on the sign. Let's go check it out. I like the tie-dye in the windows. How long have you been waiting here? I just got here a couple minutes ago. Oh, I took a wrong turn. Anything good in here? This place is awesome. Oh man, they got they got cassettes on the wall back there. I'm, I might be interested in looking at those. A little bit of everything. A little bit of everything. A little bit of Bad Company, ACDC, Blink 182. Look at all the CDs. And behind me. There's Blu-rays and DVDs and another whole wall of CDs. Look at that. That is incredible. That is so much. The store goes way back there too. Looks like someone's a celebrity here. And the previous Oh, she is. Okay, previous owner. So it's been open for 50 years. I like the shirts they have up there. 1971. 15 bucks for a t-shirt. Next to the, the cure set over there, we got the photograph. And Metallica. That's the best Metallica album, too. Yeah. Those, those are the owners right there in the middle. 1971. That's you. That's me. Look at that. We might have to get a band together so we got something to play here. Yeah, we can get a band together. We can practice our set. We can we can go. We can practice all year and we can get good. Get it nice and tight. Like you too. Yeah. Oh, a lot of soundtracks down here. I like soundtracks. Sleepless in Seattle, Mr. Holland's Opus. When Harry Met Sally. Oh, I forgot about this movie. Phenomenon, John Travolta. I personally grew up on classic rock. In my high school days, I was in a hardcore punk metal band, a band called Strength and What Remains. I was the original drummer, then bassist. So I really fell in love with punk rock and hardcore. So I love all kinds of music is what I'm saying. So there's all kinds of variety here for me. Steven Stills Live, that's that's pretty cool. A triumph, wow, I'm, I'm seeing names I haven't seen in a long time. Steely Dan, I even like that. Steppenwolf, Cat Stevens, Al Stewart, Rod Stewart, that's dad's favorite. He's a big Rod Stewart fan. 
This is a good album. I did get into hip hop too. Dr. Dre. You should listen to some Dre. The greatest Neil Young album of all time, Harvest. Definitely my favorite with Old Man and Heart of Gold. Here's a trip down memory lane. I actually had this exact copy. Not this exact copy, but this exact version of this CD. That is sick. Look at that. The Mortal Kombat soundtrack. Finish him. Finish him. Metal, metal, metal. I love how they did that. Check it out. All kinds of stuff in here. Black Sabbath. Ozzy Osbourne. Danzig. That's awesome. I like some Danzig. I like some Misfits as well. Soundtrack to Blade Runner 2049. A movie I really enjoyed, especially that that fight scene between those two. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen it, sorry. Ooh, Broxdale, that was a good one. Good music in that one. Death Wish 2 soundtrack? You gotta be kidding me. I might I might have to get this one. I'm a big fan of the Charlie Bronson. Who's to blame? The, the chase? Wow, okay. So you can get the DC Cab soundtrack starring Mr. T. Look, it's ripping that car door off there. That's pretty cool. Anyone ever see that? I've never seen it. Okay, I'm grabbing the Batman Forever soundtrack because I used to have this when I was a kid. And I really enjoyed it. And plus, I like Batman Forever. I thought it was a good one. A lot of people didn't like it, but I liked it. Oh, happy record store day. You got the Mortal Kombat, huh? From last month. I'm really excited. It was sold out last month. I thought that was it. I was never going to see it again, but we got it in. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah, I got my pickups here. I can't believe I bought the Batman Forever soundtrack for the second time in my life. <laughs> I 20, believe it. 20 something years later. Shout out to East West Records. That place is awesome. Check it out. Not far from Disney even. On the road again. It is record store day and I am hungry. We're going to Four Rivers Barbecue. Fast forward to Kissimmee. Now at Four Rivers Barbecue. They got some good stuff here and I'm hungry. He doesn't know I'm standing behind them. He has no idea I'm standing here. Ha <laughs> ha, I gotcha. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Did you order yet? No. All right, cool. I'm hungry. Decisions, decisions. I think I'll have me a adopt a pet bucket. 10, two, and four. You're off your spot, man. There you go. I'm not gonna drop it. I'm not gonna drop it. I'm gonna drop it here, though. What did you get? Burnt ends. Burnt ends. Actually, that's pretty good. Extreme close up. Woo! Oh man, phenomenal. We're saying goodbye to Jason because I'm going to Magic Kingdom and he's going home. But wait one second. He told me about a record that he picked up. Actually, a few more records. Let's share those. It's record store day. We got to share them today. It is record store day. Let's see what you got in there. What, the clutch kit? The clutch box. It's the size of an actual clutch box. Have you ever seen it like a real clutch? It's about that size. 16 LPs. They're good. I didn't, I didn't listen to them as... I don't listen to them as much, but they're a good band. Have you ever heard of... Um, there's a YouTube guy. His name Adam the Woo. <laughs> yeah. You ever heard of him? Yeah, he's a fan, isn't he? This, this happens to be probably his favorite band of all time. It's a good, good. I actually told him about this. I don't. I don't know if he knew about it already or not. But he said, "Heck yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah." That's Let's what he what would say. Got. <laughs> got asking Alexandria for you heavy metalheads out there. I like that. I, I listened to this actually the other day. Get you pumped, doesn't it? And yeah, I was like, "This is this is pretty amazing." I'm gonna go ahead and buy that. I picked up one of the infectious screws, limited oh, to two thousand copies worldwide. And like she was saying at East West, there's. 9,000 record stores participating in Record Store Day now, so pretty lucky to get some of those lower numbered vinyl. The who. Not the Guess Who, the Who. <clears throat> the Who's explosive 1967 performance. Is that finally the... available on vinyl. I don't know how they captured an explosion on vinyl, but they did it. Was that the one in Cincinnati? Oh, too soon. Remember. Gold member, gold member, yeah, baby, yeah. <laughs> That's Austin Powers three. We have. I, I, I'm horrible at the impression. Austin Powers. Yeah, baby. One. <laughs> Spy who oh, shagged there. me. Those are good laughs. And then, uh, I think this is probably part two. There you go. 
Or is this? Groovy baby. No, this is part one. That's part one. Yeah, this is yes. one. This is part two. Part three. International Man of Mystery. Even though I don't see it on there. On it, orange and pink vinyl. It doesn't say International Man of Mystery, right? That's the first one? Yeah. Uh, Sukka Sukka Slim Shady. Slim Shady. Seven shady. Uh, back I'm remix so off of the new. Oh, I saw that. Uneventful Days. The uh, Black Mirror episode. Black Mirror. Soundtrack. Picked up an old specials, 10 inch. Specials, good. Dub mixes. New Bouncing Souls. This wasn't a record store day record, but it was a limited variant to 350. And I've got a different one that I ordered, so I'm like, yeah, I'll add that to my collection. Uh, Slaves to the Grind, second album by Skid Row. This was one of the most sought after Skid records Row. this record store day. I saw them twice. Limited to 4,000 copies worldwide. Whoa, so that's pretty, that's, what, like, that's a big deal. Like she said, that means less than half of the stores participating in record store day got one copy of this. So I'm pretty stoked to get that. Yeah, that's awesome, man. He's uh, the most popular Pepper album, arguably. Kona, Kona Town, Town on a limited color. So I'm not a huge fan or anything, but I gave this a listen to last night. I've been listening to the stuff before I, yeah. I buy it. That's a, it was that's a, a pretty cool. good record, so I picked it up. It's a cool album cover. Uh, this one I'm really stoked about, Miles too. The Davis. Miles Davis rarities and uh, outtakes from Bitches Brew Sessions. This is going to be amazing. That was an amazing record store day. The Clutch Box. You're satisfied, aren't I you? I got the Clutch Box. And I got uh, Death Wish Part 2 soundtrack. This is what I, I was can go home about. now. When I went to sleep <laughs> last night, like, oh, I gotta go to sleep so I can get up early and try to get that Clutch Box. Now, I got it. Now pop the clutch. No, this is not the entrance to Walt Disney World, but we'll be going under a similar structure very soon. Now that's more like it. This one's a lot more magical, isn't it? Oh boy, I'm here. Oh, I'm excited. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Magic Kingdom. We were here two weeks after the reopening and one week after the reopening. I've been here since then several times, but I didn't have the camera with me. I'm sorry, I apologize. It was a hang with friends day too, but today I'm showing the hang with friends moments. Pass holder entrance is wide open. That is I. Thank you. Oh yes, and it is the spooky time of year. My favorite decor to see on Main Street, USA. Right here at the town square. I begin my journey. Just gotta go have some fun and hang out. Looks like I made it just in time for the Happy Halloween Parade. Hi, Minnie. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, Mickey. Good to see you again, buddy. Oh, this is fun. I don't care how old you are. Age is in your heart. This is this is this is so fun to see. Look at that castle. Cinderella's castle still looking beautified, refreshed and fine. I'm still celebrating its new color scheme. Recently repainted. I love it. I'm gonna celebrate it for about a year. I love it. It's, it looks fantastic. Do you like the new paint job? Impartial. Impartial. I like the new color scheme. I've been I've, I've been celebrating it. I haven't lost any sleep over it. No, I think it's it looks refreshed and refined. I've been I've been uh, bringing it up and saying every time I come in, I, I always make a point of how much I like it. It's, it's nice. I, I think it's awesome. I didn't even notice it until you mentioned it. No, nope. no, you didn't notice it. I noticed it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I forgot. You forgot but that I it. Noticed it. Yeah, it looks great. <laughs> also enjoying the beautiful castle. Danny 702. Hello! I got friends everywhere today. I've been record store day and now hanging out at Magic Kingdom. Yeah, fancy meeting you here. Fancy meeting you here too. Inside Pinocchio's Village House, we ducked in to cool down and get some treats. Yeah. Order 6344 is complete. Thank you very much. The blue raspberry was good. How was that? It looks like you hated it. <laughs> no, I hated taking it out of the little cupcake thing to share. But it's amazing. Was that the poison apple? Yeah, not so poison apple. Well, if you want to see the beforehand, you have to go check out is, well, no, Danny's video, maybe Adam's really. video. I'm still, I'm still consuming this. Yeah, that's, I learned there's zero calories in this Tampa Jack. Why is that? Because people say that when you're at Disney, calories don't count. I have to concur. I think that is true. But if you're an annual pass holder, calories do count. Oh no! So I am out of luck. Oh man, me too. We gotta put our magic bands away. Maybe that's the trick. Oh yeah. Yeah, just take them off. Yep, you're good. No, my calories. 
<laughs> no calories. Hey, can you get that for me? I'm, I'm done. <laughs> so good. All right, I win. Look at this. That means I just lost all the Four Rivers barbecue. I ate there. Two Mark. minutes to uh, two minutes till the show. If you know this clock, you know what show we're about. Country Bear Jamboree just in time. Jafar! Jafar! Hey! Big Thunder Mining Company. Huge nuggets of gold and gold bars. That can only mean one thing. It's Big Thunder Mountain time. Alright, all aboard. Alright, we've got Adam the Woo and Michael K. Yeah. In car 11. Danny and I in car 12. Look at that. All right, hands up. Again, I really love that paint job. Have I said that before? Cinderella's castle looks great. The sun's in the west now. It's been such a fun day hanging out with friends all over Orlando, starting in Winter Park, and now here at Magic Kingdom. So good to be here during the Halloween season. I love seeing all the decorations today. Goodbye, Pumpkin Mickey. The next time I'm here, you probably won't be hanging there. Well, guys, we're taking the boat back to the TTC parking lot. It was a good day. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. I am Tampa J. There's much ahead. So much ahead. Man, it's so beautiful out here. I love Magic Kingdom. It was such a great day. Record store day with Jason. I got to hang out with this crew for a while. Good friends. See you guys. You're my friend too. Bye bye. There's much ahead. Hi, Mr. Crow. Good to see you, Mr. Crow. Oh, thank you. All right. Yeah, Hitchcock would be proud. <laughs> so proud.